Paul, one of the techs at Microcenter. Recently at Microcenter, we've made some updates and changes to the ESET antivirus online renewal process. We've tried to simplify and streamline the process. One of the changes we think you'll be most excited about is the fact that you no longer need a Microcenter Insider account to purchase an ESET renewal. If you're purchasing an ESET renewal and another product, however, you will need to log into your Insider account. Let's go ahead and take a look at this video that's going to step you through the entire process. Let's get started. Okay, to get started, if it's if it's time to renew your ESET, you'll see a little pop-up down by the ESET icon, the orange with an exclamation point. So what you want to do is go ahead and open up the internet and go to microcenter.com and then scroll down and click on the ESET renewal button and here it's going to ask for the username. Now to find the username, you want to go back to ESET and hold the control button down and hit the U button. That's going to open up a box that's going to have your current username and password, but for this we only need the username. So go ahead and copy that and then paste it in there and go ahead and click on the button. Okay, so now we're in the ESET store, so obviously you want to find the same product you have. If you have uh, NOD32, you want to select the renewal for that, or Smart Security. In this case, it's NOD32, and this is a good opportunity to bring up this new feature. If you're just coming out to renew ESET, you don't have to log into your Microcenter Insider account. But if you purchase another item, then you will be required to log into that Insider account. We don't want to add an additional item because we just want to do our renewal, so go ahead and add to the cart. Let's check out now. Go ahead and fill in your billing information, your name, address, phone number, zip code. Okay, now you want to click on the uh, confirm and continue button. Alright, now it's going to ask for your billing information. So go ahead and put your credit card information in, the expiration date, and the little three or four digit code. And click on complete order. Okay, that's going to take us to a screen thanking you for the order, and then it's going to give you the serial number of the ESET product that you just purchased. So what we're going to do is just go ahead and highlight that serial number and copy it. Okay, and then we want to open up ESET. We want to click on product activation. And then we want to select the first selection, activate using an activation key. So go ahead and select that and click on next. And here it's going to ask you to put in the activation key and then some other user information. And then go down and click on activate. Now it'll just take a few moments to go ahead and activate. Uh, no longer do you have to go to a website and fill out a form. Uh, you can do it all within ESET itself. So that's one of the improvements that we're we're hoping everyone is happy with. Uh, we, we certainly are happy or happy with it and it makes it easier for everyone. So the first thing ESET's going to do is go ahead and download the updated virus signatures. These are going to come out every day and it'll do it automatically. Now if you want to update it manually, uh, on the left hand margin you just click on update and then you click on update now. Just give that a few minutes. And now if you go back to the home screen you'll see that uh, maximum protection is ensured. And that's how you install and update ESET version 6. If you have any other questions come visit us at www.microcentertech.com or visit our no-wait chat service at chat.microcentertech.com.